coming back to the BNS channel. My name is Edie Ann, and I want to bring us back to the basics today. So one of the things that I've talked about in videos way back in the day is something that I called the Pay It Forward program. And the Pay It Forward program is something that new consultants can do. But here's the thing, as seasoned consultants, and I've been with Sensi for almost 14 years, we forget that going back to the basics sometimes is super beneficial for our business. And so this is how the Pay It Forward program works. Um, there's some pretty strate strategic uh, things that I do during this process. And so I'm gonna share those with you guys today. So you're gonna take a product, and here's the thing, in our starter kits we get product, we get a warmer, we get fan diffuser, I don't know, whatever it is that you got in your kit. You're gonna take that and it's matching product, right? So if it's a warmer, you're gonna take wax. If it's a fan diffuser, you're gonna take pods. So I'm gonna use the tabletop fan diffuser as our product today and some pods that I'm gonna take. And usually I'll take a scent like Luna because that is the number one selling scent that Scentsy has sold. And it's pretty basic. Everybody seems to like it. It's kind of an all around scent and so it's usually a pretty good um, match. Now, the other thing you have to consider is you don't want something too fragrant um, because more than likely you're gonna be bringing these into an office of sorts. So here's, here's how this works. So you're gonna take your tabletop fan diffuser and your set of pods and you're gonna walk into your doctor's office, you're gonna walk up to the counter and you're gonna say, hey, um, I am looking for people's opinions. That's all, just opinions. Would you be okay if I left this here for three days so that your office could try it, let people um, try how it works, see if they like the fragrance, and get me some opinions? And so when I come back in three days, that's all I'm gonna ask is for your opinion. Would that work? So they're gonna say one of two things, yes or no. If they say no, then I would ask why. Is there a rule? Is there something that you know would warrant them not being able to have it there? Um, and if they do say something like, well, we're not allowed to have fragrance in this office, say, well, do you wanna take it home and try it? And then I can come back here and get it from you. Um, because you're wanting to make sure that somebody tries it. You're needing an opinion, okay? If they say yes, then say, do you, it's super easy to use. I can set it up for you if you'd like. Otherwise, all you need to do is plug it in, hit the button, turn it on, put the pods on the inside, and let it do its thing. And I'll be back in three days, okay? So then you leave. No catalogs, no, you could leave a business card in case they have something that goes wrong and they need to ask a question. But other than that, you're not leaving materials for them, okay? In three, d three days, when you come back, you're gonna come to the desk, you're gonna be like, hey, I left a product here for you to try, um, and I'm here to pick it up. And so they're like, okay, well, then we'll go get it. Say, okay, I have a question. Did you like it? Let them answer. Was the scent to your liking? They'll let you know what they thought. Was it easy to use? Okay, so those are the three questions that I usually ask. Now there's gonna be a plethora of responses to some of those, but the main three answers you're gonna get are yes, we liked it, no, we didn't, I didn't like the scent, okay? And you're gonna have responses to those because you at this time will have a catalog that you can show them. And so if they didn't like it, ask them why so that you have an opportunity to give them some education, right? Um, two, if they did love it, they may not wanna give it back to you. <laughs> that happens too. Um, and they may wanna buy it on the spot. And so that if that happens, great, obviously. Um, I usually tell them, well, you can't have this one because this is my demo, but here's a catalog to order your own and we can get it shipped directly to you. Um, and if they didn't like the scent, say, you know what, great, that's awesome because with our pods, we have about 40 different scents that you can pick from and here they are. As 
you are leaving. So here's the here's the the biggest part of this that I think people forget. You're going to potentially get a sale, you're going to potentially get um, a change of scent that they want to try or whatever. Um, but if they say no, or as you're leaving with your demo, I want you to strategically do this. And it makes a difference because I think that that authenticity of you forgetting or saying, oh, wait a minute. Um, as you're leaving, I usually turn around and say, hey, wait a minute, you know what? Do you know somebody else that would like to try this, like a different office, or do you have a friend that works somewhere that you think they have a great uh, opinion about this product? Because remember, the ultimate reason for you going there was to gain an opinion, not to gain sales, right? But we all know that putting the scent under their nose is going to sell it, because that's how Scentsy works. Um, and so now we're going to pay it forward, right? We're going to ask them for that referral. We're going to ask them if there's somebody else that might enjoy, oh, you know what? So-and-so works at this office. You should bring it down to them. I bet they'd love to try it. Okay. Um, there are multiple things that could come from this interaction and you need to be ready for it. I don't mean being ready like to drop off a basket party or whatever. Be ready because they might want to do that and say, well, you know what? I would love to see if I could get this for free and whatever, right? You can do that conversation. But the pay it forward program is ultimately to gain an opinion, to get referrals, and to put it under their nose. That is the purpose of the pay it forward program and it works almost every time, seamlessly. Try it. I would love to hear your experiences with this program. Um, if you're trying to get PRB this month, then that would be a great way to get you started or in front of people that you probably haven't been in front of yet. All right. I hope you enjoy this program. If you have any questions about it, please ask and I'll be more than happy to answer, but go out and try it. I bet you'll love it. Bye.